Hey guys, what is up? Redpen Mining here. How you guys all doing? Hope you're doing really well and have a really great day. In this video, I just want to talk about recent motherboards for mining that you can purchase and they're not crazy expensive. And I am not talking about the Asus B250 mining expert board. These are ridiculously expensive now and I can't believe people are paying this much for these types of motherboards today. You can see here, recently sold on eBay, $749, which is way too crazy and so i want to go through a more essentially a cost effective way to build a mining rig you know you don't need to have these 19 gpu uh, mining rigs 12 gpu mining rigs in my opinion sticking with you know six gpu mining rigs or seven some other boards you can go up to seven or eight depending on the m.2 slots you can utilize those and they are the best perfect as you can buy these motherboards easily on amazon today so everything i talk about i'll have links down below really appreciate it anything you guys buy on amazon helps me out supports the channel but let's go through some parts here and i'm just specifically talking about motherboards and i'll show you guys a cpu that we can associate with an asus prime z590-v so this is like a brand new like uh, generation motherboard from intel Okay, uh, it's 159 or you can maybe buy this Z590-P, but uh, I looked at this and it only has four PCIe slots, but it does have two M.2 slots. Uh, but let me let me talk about this one here I recommend getting, uh, which I'll have linked down below. Uh, this is a Asus Prime Z590-V. So looking at the picture here, it's got five PCIe slots, but it also has two m.2 slots so what you can do to in order to add another six or seven gpus is you can utilize these types of mining riser adapters okay m.2 to usb or an m.2 to pcie adapter so you can plug in the riser the x1 adapter into into here or you can get this instead where you don't need the x1 adapter Okay, so either or, I've I've used both before and it, it seems to be just fine, but with that, right, you need a stick of RAM. I highly recommend getting like the Corsair Vengeance 8 gigabytes uh, stick of RAM right here. And as well as to go with this motherboard is this G6400 processor. Definitely recommend getting this, only $93, okay? Now, what I just showed here is readily available on Amazon right now. As of recording this video, I'm going to release it tomorrow, okay? It's October 24th. You guys are going to see this video tomorrow because this is stuff I looked up right now that you can literally buy and it's available on Amazon and amazing for mining in my opinion. I have a bunch of Z390P motherboards and I have a few Z490P motherboards. Asus Prime motherboards, these are just amazing for mining, but this is the latest and greatest one from Asus. But the thing is, this one compared to the Z490 or uh, the Z390, they had six PCIe slots. These ones, they don't have six PCIe slots, okay? They only have five. So that is why I talked about having those M.2 adapters. You can see these, uh, this slot right here, this one right here, and this one right here is where you can put the M.2 adapter, okay? These guys right here, which I'll have linked down below. You guys can check it out. Okay, so that is like a new age motherboard that you can buy now on Amazon, readily available. But of course, there is other alternatives to not just buying, you know, new stuff. If you can find on your local used market, Facebook Marketplace, Craigslist, Kijiji, wherever you live, uh, you can maybe find like a pre-built machine, right? And then you can buy a one to four PCIe adapter like like this. I have a video actually uh, showing, which I'll have linked down below, making a HP pre-built machine into a mining rig. And... I was able to get six GPUs to work on this just fine. Results may vary though, right? Depending on the type of machine that you buy that's uh, used, of course, right? But the big thing is that you need the expander card, the one to four uh, PCIe adapter. Okay, so uh, let's just see here. Uh, I actually don't have it up here, but I'll type it in here. Four to one PCIe adapter. This is pretty much what expands a X4 or X8 or X16 slot on the motherboard into... Uh, to have the ability to put four GPUs, okay? So you're going to be plugging the risers, the USB cables, into this expander card, the expander hub. So pretty cool, pretty cool. And uh, I've used tons of these before, and they work just great. 
on uh, specifically on older gen stuff uh, computers as well. So yeah, check this video out if you guys are interested. And then to go along talking about maybe some other alternative places to buy motherboards. Uh, Mining Cave, they also have a mining motherboard. It's a 12 GPU one though, 245 USD. So it's a little bit higher on the higher end. If you're planning to do 12 GPUs, I guess you're paying for the density. You can buy the CPU as well. All right, they also put in the stick of RAM if you need. Uh, altogether, about $433 USD for a 12 GPU motherboard. So you guys can compare the cost there to buying a, uh, you know, uh, Asus Prime Z590V for 6 GPUs or 7 GPUs versus 12 GPUs. It just depends what you want. In my opinion, building GPU mining rigs that are 6 to 8 GPUs is going to be much easier to handle, to manage, and uh, versus a 12 GPU mining rig, in my opinion, speaking from experience. I mean, it's great to have, you know, huge mining rigs, but uh, it, it's definitely a pain to manage, and especially if something goes wrong, troubleshooting a, a large GPU mining rig is going to be definitely a nightmare. Okay, another place that you guys can buy motherboards and CPUs and stuff is Bees Crypto Mining. And he is in Canada, but he does ship to USA for a little bit of a fee, I believe. So, but anyways, he's got a lot of different motherboards and risers and expander cards here as well, if you guys need, uh, which is available. He even has these uh, M.2 to USB adapters that you guys can see right here. So, there you go. Expands another GPU, if you need, on the M.2 slot. And uh, the expander card, but motherboards, okay? So looking at, uh, let's look at this one right here. So this is an 8 GPU mining motherboard, uh, B85. So it's a little bit older generation chipset, as well as the older generation CPU, G3220. But it comes with a stick of RAM, and the price is... 269 Canadian uh, in USD for my American friends. That's going to be about $210 roughly. Uh, but this is another great alternative for a mining motherboard that uh, that you can buy and available right now on B's Crypto Mining. So that's that's pretty cool. Okay, so yeah, link down below if you guys want to check out his website. Next one is mineshop.eu. If you guys are in Europe or so, you guys can see there are some available motherboards here. Uh, TB250 BTC Pro, 169 uh, euro. So I believe that's like 200 USD or so. And uh, if you need processors, mineshop.eu also has processors as well. And uh, depending on which generation motherboard you have, you have to be mindful looking at which socket generation CPU is compatible with the motherboard you have, okay? I've had many, many people that I've helped troubleshoot, figure out why their motherboard isn't turning on or uh, aren't, isn't displaying anything, and that's because they have the wrong CPU on their generation motherboard. So just recently, actually, uh, it's not this processor, but it was another uh, comparable LGA processor that could fit on an ASRock H110 Pro. And that motherboard definitely only supports 6th or 7th gen CPUs, not 8 or 9. Okay, so the gentleman had a 9th gen CPU plugged in into a 6th or 7th gen compatible motherboard, the ASRock H110. So it, of course, wouldn't work, wouldn't boot, wouldn't show up at anything on the screen. So guys, yeah, just be mindful of, you know, what types of CPUs you are associating with the motherboards that you are buying. Okay, and then lastly, another place that you can buy motherboards right now that are in stock is Nerd Gears. Uh, look, at they have a mining rig starter kit, H81 motherboard, CPU, RAM, grade B. So it's not it's not brand new, but it's 249. You get everything all in one, and this is a perfect six GPU mining motherboard right here. And uh, yeah, 249. So uh, if if I were to compare though this and any other maybe motherboards, anything of these other stores I just mentioned. Would I buy the Z590P instead with the, uh, so it's 160 plus the uh, CPU, which is $93. So that's a good $250 plus, you know, another uh, one, a stick of RAM. So altogether, it's going to be about $300 for a new age motherboard. Would I, would I recommend doing that? In my opinion, yes, I, I would probably go with a newer age generation CPU, though it doesn't really matter. Like you can mine on any motherboard CPU generation. It doesn't matter, right? The H81 motherboard here on Nerd Gears is pretty old, but it's 249. It's a little bit cheaper than buying the, the new age combo here, the five the Z590 Prime, the Asus Prime board. So but you're you are getting newer 
generation stuff. And Asus is very, very reliable in my opinion. I've had no issues with Z490s and then uh, I'm actually thinking about buying a few of these Z590s uh, to test out as well. But yeah, it's very, very simple in my opinion. And uh, th this is just stuff that's available on Amazon. You don't have to go too crazy into buying these Asus Mining Expert boards or maybe the ASRock H110s, which are uh, very expensive as well. Yeah. Oh, okay, not too bad. 249 recently sold. Oh, 425. Oh, that's with the CPU and RAM. So uh, the, the ASRock H110s are definitely one of my favorite motherboards. But for the price of these now, I... I just can't I can't stomach buying these right now. I would I would probably go for for me personally the Z590 V in my opinion. So anyways guys, thank you for watching. Uh, let me know your thoughts. I think this whole week I want to make videos that will help new miners that are coming into the space recently as uh, I know a lot of people are looking to get into, into mining. So if you guys have any other video ideas that you want me to search up or look through, let me know down below. But if you guys want to buy anything or anything that I showed on today's video, just uh, links down below in the description. It'll help me out a lot if you purchase anything. So thank you guys for watching. Have a good one and peace out.